So what is a novice monk? They are candidates for higher ordination. And in the Laos, Thai, Cambodian, Burmese, and Sri Lankan culture, they are typically young kids under the age of 20, training to purify our minds through morality. Homage to the blessed one, the worthy one, rightly self-awakened one, to follow the Buddha's path. Many novices ordain and this robe within a few days because they're doing it for familial rituals such as the death in the family. But all novices, regardless of age, are on a journey of purification, taking on 10 precepts which help build a base of moral character worthy of veneration. We spend our mornings chanting the Buddha's teachings in Pali, the old Buddhist language, and in English so we understand what is being said. Birth is stressful, aging is stressful, death is stressful. Sape Sankara Anicca, all mental volitions are inconstant. Sape Tama Anatati, all phenomena are not self. Immediately after chanting, we go into meditation using the Anapanasati technique, which is mindfulness of the breath, which is much harder than it sounds. After our meditation session, we go and chant in the morning again with Laotian translations with our abbot, Ajahn Wun. Typically, we would make breakfast for any higher ordained bhikkhus, but in this instance, we are taking care of the temple grounds with light work. So some have already put um, offerings to Buddha. Our parking lot actually gets plowed by an outside company. So I would actually take the whole uh, snow blower <laughs> and I would do the whole thing. And apparently we had a snow plow company that would actually come and do it. So all the way down to the main road, both sides. Make sure that nobody gets injured. So I'm gonna lay out some salt. I forgot that today was Wednesday. And I have a one-on-one -on -one, uh, meditation session and Dhamma lesson with a devotee before I go on alms round. So I will take us on Bindabhat after the personal one-on-one um, -on -one, um, lesson with our devotee. And then we'll go from there. 6.37. Sun rises at about 7.10 right now. So we're a lot about half an hour. Called this twilight time. Half an hour to 40 minutes is like twilight, so technically um, this is now um, part of the, the time that is allowable for food. And, um, so I have a shake, a power shake uh, that was made. Um, so as a novice, I'm allowed to make food and prepare food. Um, I can make it any time, uh, but I'm not supposed to eat it with, I'm not supposed to eat it outside of the time that's allowable. So I'm going out into alms round. Um, I've been doing it for probably a full year this week, yeah. And um, this is to allow me to appreciate generosity, understand the Buddhist teachings, and not take things for granted. So this is why I do go out to alms round.
novice monks are responsible for 10 precepts. However, they are also responsible for 75 sakya rules, which are training modesty rules. This is for their candidacy to become a bhikkhu. I am very fortunate to still have my family here as monks are not allowed to ask for anything specifically and must appreciate all allowable donations with appreciation. Some donors travel long distances to this temple just to make offerings and build merit. <laughs> As with anything, some days you are left with huge platters of food, and some days you only have what's in your alms bowl. As novices, we train ourselves to be at ease with this fact, so that we do not succumb to hunger and live at ease. We practice mindfulness throughout the day, whether eating, doing chores, reading, studying, and even walking. Just 
They have a sandwich. After lunch, typically donors stay and build more merit via tambun. However, on this particular day, they were not around. So I had to pick up and live at ease and make it easy for them on their next visit. And the novices will gain confidence in the skills learned and build humility and appreciation for the food and shelter that has been provided by them by the generosity of donors. This daily routine is vital in retraining the mind which has been conditioned by the world of craving. Chance of rain with visibility when nautical miles or less. Thursday, southwest winds 20 to 30 knots, becoming west to northwest 10 to 20 knots. Seas 5 to 9 feet. By having a small set of rules given at first, it makes the training process easier and gradual. By taking on all 227 rules, it would be overwhelming and the likelihood of disrobing imminent. So the novice's journey is that of courage by renouncing that which they loved and had known and of hope so that they may learn the true Dharma and pass it on to later generations. See you all in the morning and start the day all over again. This is Samanera, one little Buddhavat, practicing for higher ordination for the realization of Nidrota, cessation, Vimutia, freedom, release, and Nibbana, to be unconditioned. So, may you all be happy, may you all be well. May you find the eternal bliss in Nepal.